Hello, how to find the value of x in this equation? For this equation, if you can find the same denominator, it's so quite complicated, right? So, therefore, you can firstly, first, first step, you can minus 1 for the both sides. Therefore, we can have x minus 1 over 2004, right? So, therefore, you can test for minus 1 and x squared plus x minus 2 over 2003 and x squared minus 1. And, and so, therefore, we have minus x minus 3 over 2002, right? So, when you when you minus four minus two so you need to plus one and then it's equals x minus four over two thousand and one yes and minus one everyone see that minus plus is equal zero and so we have minus one minus one right yes minus both sides for one so everyone see that x minus 1 you can rewrite 2004 over 2004 yes minus 1 you write minus 2004 over 2004 and plus x minus 2 and minus 2003 over 2003 and x squared minus when you say minus here you can say x minus 3 minus 4 minus is equal to plus yeah you need to change the size of minus 1 so you write 2002 over 2002 yes is equals plus 1 minus plus is equal to plus 1 and is equals x minus 4 minus 2001 minus 2001 for this method you can find the common factor so everyone can see x minus 2005 right over 2004 and plus x minus 2005 over 2003 and x squared x brackets x minus 2000 and 2005 yes over 2002 so you can see on the right hand side we have x minus 2005 over 2000 and one. So therefore, you can see x minus two thousand and five over four plus x minus two thousand and five over two thousand and sorry two thousand and four two thousand and three and minus x minus two thousand and five over two thousand and two. So you need to. You need to move on the right on the left hand side. So we need to change the, the number x minus two thousand n and five over two thousand and one is equals zero, right? Equals to zero. So you you look at that is a common factor. You need to take it out. X minus two thousand and five, yes, times one. 2004 and nice one plus 1 2003 yeah and next nice one minus 2000 and and 2 and next nice one minus 1 over 2000 yes and 1 is equals 0 so in this case everyone can see Everyone can see for for this expression is all square.
not different is uh, is always not equal to zero. So therefore, in this equation, we have developed x minus two thousand and five equals zero, right? So we have the value of x equals two thousand two thousand and five, right? We have the only solution for the equation. Yes. So thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Love you all. Bye bye.